camera put 50 pounds on me. Lead. Lead. Because this mohawk ain't working out on TV. Hey, welcome to the Chill Spot. I'm Corinne. I'm Lisa. <laughs> Today is Friday, November the 1st. Can you believe that? Oh, wow. No. Pretty soon it's going to be exciting. Turkey Day. I love it Thanksgiving. Is. That's mm -hmm. my favorite holiday, Thanksgiving. Do you sit around the table and have everyone say what they're thankful for? Sometimes. Depends I do on that at my family. Depends mm -hmm. on how hungry I am. Well, they those. don't get nothing unless they tell me what they're thankful for. <laughs> it's mean, but it works. Aww. It does. <laughs> well, Sunday... November the 3rd is actually daylight savings time. So wow. we're going to get that extra sleep. Oh, good. Good. Yeah, the extra hour. So you should move your clock back one hour on Sunday. So daylight starts at 2 a.m. So when you turn back your clock, it should say 1 a.m. So at 2 a.m., you're going to go back to 1 a.m. It was always interesting when I worked night shift. On daylight savings time night mm -hmm. you know because you end up working an extra hour mm -hmm. and then sometimes charting could be a little bit difficult but yeah that would be yeah that would be yeah. odd be that was in the days of hand charting nowadays it's all computerized so I'm sure there's a compensation in mechanism there. in there but Benjamin Franklin known is actually known as the father of DST, Daylight Savings Time, hmm. which I never knew that. I didn't know that. Mm -mm. No. Huh. He, um, he was an American inventor and politician, and he said in 19, well, no, 1784 that he wanted to cut down on the use of, of candles because of the wells, oh. because of the oil. So he wanted people like to put their candle out and go to bed earlier. Mm -hmm. And for for some reason, they thought like he was a it was a joke back then. Really? Mm -hmm. But now we're doing it. Oh, but wow. he's known as the father of I did like not inventing know it. That. Yeah, it very was kind of it was kind of it was kind of cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So if you are working that night shift, check with your um, employee, go over your work employee handbook about um, being paid for that extra hour. Day shift, please make sure that you're setting your clocks up because I know day back. shift is going to want, yeah, back. Sorry, yeah. I'm glad you're <laughs> back yeah. because you know they're going to want, day shift is going to, uh, I, I am, like Drake says, squirrel, reverse. <laughs> The only way I can remember that is fall back in the yes, fall and, and then spring, spring forward. forward. Yeah. Yep. 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 And there were some studies done, um, and it says by losing that hour of sleep and daylight, they say it could trigger uh, mental illness. Hmm. Wow. More workplace injuries, um, tired while driving, increases uh, traffic accidents, and the risk of having a heart attack by doing this. Wow. Wow. But we'll gain an hour, right? Right. You're going to actually gain an hour, but they said it, but throws, take it, away. it throws your system Cir off. Probably your circadian mm -hmm. rhythm it throws off. Yeah. Yes. yes. And then I imagine a lot of our um, residents and clients and patients that have sundowners, it's going to affect them. Mm -hmm. Your Alzheimer's and dementia um, people as well, that's going to be affected. I mean, because it affects us. Well, it starts getting dark so mm -hmm. early. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's kind of... It's kind of creepy yeah. if you think about it. I yeah. mean, I don't understand why they they do this. I really don't. I think it has something to do now with farming. I don't know. Indiana don't know. used to not do it at all. And if hmm. you went to Indiana, it was strange because some parts of the state would do it, some wouldn't. And there was what they called fast time and slow hmm. time. Any of our Indiana friends... Try to explain. I know. Yes. I don't think explain they still do us. that because I think they pass state legislation where they don't. Hmm. But yes, the fast time, slow time was always very challenging when I would visit um, homes there. Homes and do it. Yeah, yeah. That would. Throw I was always you kind either early off. or late. Yeah. So just be mindful um, of this is this is going to be taking place. 
Um, what I like to do is if I'm going to be going to bed at nine o'clock, I just go ahead and set my clock and then that way mm -hmm. I don't have to worry about it, mm -hmm. you know, at, at all. And on your cell phone, it's going to automatically turn. It should, mm -hmm. but don't follow on your car, on your little car clock, because you're going to have to manually change that. And microwaves and yes. my oven and mm -hmm. yes everything so just be um just be careful that day make sure that you arrive to work on time uh, make sure that you uh, find out exactly how you're going to be paid don't be going to the time keeper and banging on her door saying you know where's my extra hour and everything else to pay so um be respectful that day too and uh have a great weekend and uh stay safe and remember you, you matter. matter.